my name's Tom Berry. I've uh, been repurposing, painting, and uh, reimagining guitars for quite some time now. A lot of the ideas that I have for some of the other guitars that I do, it usually starts with um, a look from playing it. Every guitar is going to inspire you to do something different from guitar to guitar because they don't all look the same, they all don't feel the same. So there's kind of an idiosyncrasy there with what you end up writing based on how it feels and what it looks like. I kind of translate an idea down, but I don't know if I'm going to end up painting it or using it as a, a 3D representation or whatever, but none of that is being planned as I do it. I take a couple of medications that make my hands tremble when I try to do something that's very uh, specific or delicate. And I used, I used to not paint because of that, and I would avoid certain songs when I was playing guitar because of that. But I've since gotten to a place where I try to incorporate it into what I'm doing kind of like uh, not covering up a mistake, but kind of using that as a stepping stone for a different idea. Most of what I'm doing is, is meant to be therapeutic and it's meant to be kind of random because it's a good way to kind of disappear. The whole thing has just been more of a meditation for me. It's kind of relaxing. I tend to do it when the rest of my family is asleep. I think I have to have a certain amount of privacy to do any of it. Because if I, if I know that they're active, or if I know that I might be needed, it's hard to go in the zone. I remember my son, this is for Tommy, when Tommy was probably three or four, I, uh, I showed him Starry Night by Van Gogh. I had this big poster of it. And uh, he said, wow, that's really beautiful, like without prompting. I was like, oh, do you like that? Why? And he said, he said, I just think it's beautiful. And it was a very weird thing for him to say because he said it completely out of the blue. That was like the first piece of art that he was really outwardly like, that is good, I like it. You know, at the end of it, it's for Tommy and no one else is gonna have this guitar. No one else will have something like this and that's kind of the point. He can call it his. Just needs to dry now. to be played yet because it's not done drying. Look at this. <laughs> That's awesome.